So who am I speaking with? Roland LeBlanc from Affilius. All right, there we are at Affilius. And for those of you who want to know where Affilius is, they're at affilius.info. And uh, you guys are the domain name management people, but as I understand, uh, TLDs or top level domains are now going to be available to anyone, not just a country, correct? That's right, David. A, a, a dramatic change is about to happen on the internet. And that is that ICANN, which regulates top level domains or which domains are on the internet, is about to open up the route for new top level domains. A top level domain is, like for example, in affiliates.info, the .info is the top level domain. In adtech.com, the .com is the top level domain. And there's only been a few new top level domains ever introduced. Uh, .info was one that was right. introduced back in 2001. Uh, Biz and Moby and Asia and a few other ones were also introduced. And Affilius was actually the uh, first company to introduce a top level domain back in 2001. So, .info. so this means, I mean, I can have more than just a, you know, a .com address, which are few and far between these days. Uh, so I could create my own dot David address, I guess, or if that, that's not already taken. That, that, that's exactly right. Uh, ICANN is about to open a process. Uh, we expect this to be late 2010 or maybe 2011. We're working through the details now, where anyone can introduce, uh, can, can apply to introduce their own top-level domain. So we're going to see such things as dot NYC for New York, dot Berlin. We're going to see dot Sports. We're going to see dot Music. We're going to see all kinds of different new TLDs so for I each neighborhood. So how would I go about jumping on this opportunity before everybody else does? Well, the first thing you should do is think about whether, as you're managing a brand, whether that brand is applicable to its own top-level domain. So, for example, a, a great worldwide brand like Nike, this is the time for a, a worldwide brand to stake out its neighborhood on the Internet. And the first thing you should do, especially if you're not familiar with this process, is to link up with an expert in the space, somebody who's been through this process before, knows ICANN's processes and understands how to manage top-level domains. Somebody like Affilius, who, who already has been through a number of ICANN application processes, who did the work behind uh, dot, uh, dot .info, who helped uh, Nokia and Microsoft and Vodafone apply for dot .mobi, who apply, helped apply for dot .asia. We have more experience doing this than anybody else. Not so only it's applying, not, but launching new TLDs. Yeah, so it's not going to be as easy as registering a dot .com today. Oh, there's a lot more involved. No, there's a whole application process you're going to need to go through. You're going to need to find a registry services provider who can actually do the technology work to support your top-level domain. And that's why you should really link up with an expert for this. All right, so they can contact you directly? Yes, Roland? Yes, they can contact Arla Plant at affiliates.info. There's, there's Roland. And we'd be happy to both explain the process and help them figure out how to get started uh, and whether this is the kind of thing that they really want to do. Hey, Roland, thank you so much. Thanks, David.